Hello everyone, it's Steamboy27. It has been a long time since I've recorded. In fact, I am very late today. But, uh, there is a reason for that. Let me just get that mouse out of the way. Uh, this morning there were some people mowing the lawn. As some of you have may have known, um, I am done with uh, school for the semester, therefore I've gone home. However, the domestic life is full of many noises and sounds that sometimes cannot be averted. I'm doing a bunch of videos uh, currently right now, so maybe the first, maybe the next four or five will be done in one sitting, so that we can avoid interruptions and continue on our daily, uh, daily video upload rate. There we go. All right, so we have all four of the Sunlight gems. Alright, so it looks like thanks to Gabriel and Zeride, we have, uh, we have fixed Bruno. We have fixed the teleporter. Alright, it's gonna take several hours for him to do an internal status check, so we get the ghost sleep. Hooray. Oh, we still need to go see Nina. Okay, so I guess we can do that. I wonder if we think- are we caught up with all the materials recently? I really hope I am. Alright, so, fastest way to get to Nina, Water Fortress, and go down the stairs. Whew. We could use a- no, oh, we couldn't actually, we don't really need to pick me up. Oh, as soon as the next day starts, viewers, we're getting into the meat of the game. I think the Phenomenal Ball already knows. The thing is, my computer is starting at its maximum potential. The heat is pretty low today, so I think my computer will be able to stand for at least a few hours. Yep, there. 100%. Nothing's gonna stop us now. Here's Nina. Now we have to tell Nina that we saw something with her body. Yeah, we met someone with your body. Passo! That girl stole Nina's body. That makes no sense because then that means Passo should normally have a body. In other words, Passo must be some sort of evil spirit. Novice Summoner, a student of the Cerulean Society. I get the feeling the Cerulean Society is, has something to do with the original Summon Night games. Unfortunately, I'll never know because I don't speak any Japanese. Studying Zellum, the capital of the kingdom. Hmm. She was given a task to pick up an item. She's terrible at reading maps. She read the map upside down and headed in the wrong direction. And then... She took a boat to this island, but fell asleep on the way. She fell off the edge and she passed out. Holy cow. That is crazy. She's trying really hard to get her body back, but she can't. Hmm. She's working with Roga now. Hmm. Yeah, I didn't get the idea she was doing it for revenge either. She's just doing it for Roga, huh? Yeah, if Paso doesn't show up anymore, we can't get Paso. Eventually, we will find her and beat the crap out of her, and then get her body back. That's the perfect solution to everything. Oh, 
Oh, never mind. We can't beat the crap out of her body. That that kind of sucks. We're just gonna use. We're gonna have to knock her out with our hammer. Yeah, that's right. We'll just smack her down. Yeah, you gotta stand up to the ghost girl. All right, so it looks like we're uh, we're all done. Let's go home. Is there anywhere we've been where we didn't get to a fight 20 steps from the entrance? Wow, uh, that's that is a statement right there. Oh look, speak of the devil. Get like that, and that. Crap, 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 crap. Thought I was targeting the Taro Taro. No, sir. No. None of that today. I need a desktop computer. I'm currently looking for a job. If I can get a job, I will definitely buy a desktop computer. If I buy a desktop computer, viewers, you have no idea how many videos I will be able to render. I don't want to deal with this right now. Fall! Oh! Easy. Yeah, the, the the special abilities in this game kind of make the game broken, but it's all it's okay, it's worth it. I mean, why wouldn't you use the spin attack? I mean, come on, it's a spin attack. Link got nothing on us. I cannot wait till we get the. Uh, there's, there's an upgrade for this version. I've already talked to you about it before. I think it's called Vortex Attack, and you can move around while doing it. And it it really hurts. It re it does really well. It doesn't knock them back, so you can continuously hit them. It's amazing. But we'll get that later, a long time later. Once we get it, though, I'm never gonna stop using it. Okay, maybe I will, because it will get boring, but we're totally gonna use it when we get it. Let's go back home. Now, one thing I have, I've kept up on all the side quests, except for the Lumberjack. Now, uh, I assumed that the Lumberjack was going to happen naturally, but for some reason it doesn't work. So, uh, I suppose at any given time, I'll just have to uh, try and... I'll have to try and do something else. Oh, there we go. We have broken everything in the Lost Woods. We got a Gale Ore. Okay, so I guess we got Lost Woods. I don't quite understand how it works, but maybe the other woods weren't, uh, they weren't liable for the subquest. I'll have to look up that later. But for now, we don't have to worry about anything. We did get a boost motor earlier, though. We'll use that boost motor later. Fisherman will have new prizes tomorrow, and I cannot wait to get them. So, here's looking forward to that. Now, eventually we're going to want to use certain elements in the game. And I think we're about to come up to one of those points. Oh, hold on, what's this? Dad's fever came back again. He has been cursed by Gora. The fever won't go away because it's not really a disease, it's just a magical spell. We have to seal Gora. Once we seal Gora, the curse will disappear. So now we have another motivation to defeat Gora. And there we go. Our master has been cursed by Gora. Well, I mean, he already was, but now we know he is. Alright, so now we have a whole bunch of people to visit. Let me just save state this correctly. There we go. So, uh, here we go. Let's go talk to everyone from top to bottom. Seven people. That's a lot of people. Yeah, I guess. I guess we have to be ready. Kane's finally starting to use his sword for once. We'll beat everything that gets in our way. 
but I can't just trust boys with horns. Oh, just kidding. Just leave it to him. Let's talk to Tatiana. She had something to say, but she didn't have the heart to say it earlier. Yep, it's our fault. It's always our fault, isn't it? Yep, it's probably gonna be a long and dangerous journey. Alright, next. It's like a soap opera. I think it's funny that Gabriel has a leash on him. Yeah, so we have the same, uh, oh, he's, okay, so now we get something different. If I don't come here, I might forget what Maitropa is like. And even if I'll never be able to go back, I have to remember the way I used to be. So apparently summoning uh, a summon beast into this world is permanent. That's odd. I didn't, uh, I mean, isn't there a way to give them, get them back? Hmm. Next, Lin. We're not doing these in any particular order, so, you know. It's all Roga's fault, right? Yep, we'll find it and seal Gora in no time. Yeah, where is that thank you kiss, huh? Nobody's watching. Go ahead. Oh, oh, it faded to black viewers. You know what happened. Just kidding. We, we, they, we, that probably did not happen. And here we are. I think this is our dad's grave. I'm pretty positive now. I would love to go to a waterfall just to sit under it, like all those dudes training. I'll have to make you a helmet so I don't have to look at you. Oh, so mean. Yep, we've been, I guess, oh, if you think that's great, or wait till you see the next monster we'll fight. In fact, wait till you see the next dungeon. Alright, so, whoopsie. Okay, the last one is Nina. And there's Bogrim, looking the same as usual. How do you think we get out here, anyway? Who is Borgrim anyway? He's just some thing that lives here. I don't really understand what Borgrim is. And that's it. And we already hit a 14 minutes, something like that? So I guess for today, we're going to do side quests and then finish it up. Our aim is to find the demon edge. I'd fight monsters. Let's go. And do I have to talk to people? I always have to talk to people. Alright, so everyone's going with us. And oh, nope. Oren's putting his foot down again.
Nobody needs to take care of me. I get the feeling Master Blade just shows up every now and then just as proof, just to sound like a like a cool like a cool dude. But I can counter its effect by sheer force of will. You're a real man, Black Master Blair. Da -da 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 -da. I actually like that theme. It's pretty good for a GBA tune. Alright, so now Tatiana can come with us. Hooray. It's too bad that these guys can't actually help us in battle like in actual Summon Knight games. I know enough about Summon Knight that I know about the turn battle system. It's like Final Fantasy Tactics, I guess? I understand that my dad is whipped. <clears throat> all right, so we get, all get to go to uh, to see Bruno. Hooray! Yeah, I'm growing quite fond of this theme, even though it's fairly overused. Oh well. Dun, 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 dun. It's pretty good. All right, the whole family is going out to uh, have a good time. Let's go. And before we go, we are definitely going to take care of all the side quests. I'm oh, playing hide and seek with Kara today. Actually, Orin was handicapped during the fight we had with him. Who knows how powerful he could be? Let's see, let's go to the daily item hey, daily item corner. The heart leaf potion is now available for normal purchase. And we can create new items today, as usual. Uh, whetstones are now able to be made, but it, new, it takes a new uh, item called the polished stone. We don't have any of those yet. The hematite ring is new, it involves using the iron ring from earlier and a red ring. Let's totally make that by de-equipping our red ring. We're gonna need that if we want to take down the Rampage Rabbit again. Actually, no, we won't. We have a spin attack. Hematite Ring has a little bit more defense than the uh, normal ring. It's better than nothing. You might be wondering why I use attack power. Uh, mostly because I enjoy, for the sake of the video, it's better to just take damage and make the game flow faster. The Salesman has a Fulgur Horn today, and that is a new material we can use. It is pretty cool. Also, he mentions that he has friends in the Water and Fire Fortress, and I'm sure they like to speak with us. We should go take care of that post-haste. But, over here, at the, fisherman's, at the Fisherman's Pond, he has some new items. The Boost Motor is finally available for purchase, and, I don't know, I feel like getting, like, 15 of these, just cuz. Um, I'm, not actually, I'm not actually going to do anything special with them right now, but maybe later. Boost Motors are also pretty good for, uh, for for upgrades, because they give you more agility. It's fantastic. And uh, let's see here. Next thing we need to do is find the cat and find the little lost boy's thingy. All right, so let's go find the cat. Let's go find the thingy. We already passed in some rare metals. To oh, there's the uh, cat, though. So we don't need to talk to this guy yet. I don't think I've missed any metals. Got a rub stone, sweet. Now where's the boy? There's a boy around here somewhere. There you are. Now if I recall correctly, they're up here. The thingy's up in the town square. Just gotta press A. There it is. Got it. The heart leaf potion. Alright. Actually, I'm, well, why don't we just see how many things we have. He doesn't know- ah, uh, he's not gonna tell me how many we have? Gosh darn it, how am I supposed to know then? Well, the next time I'm gonna have to take a count and see if I've missed any through a guide. Alright, so... Before I forget to do anything, that guy mentioned that he has friends in the Water and Fire Fortress. I'm actually going to go ahead and go look at those right now. So, let's go to the Water Fortress first. And see who's inside. 
Yeah, the video's gonna be a little long today, but who know? Who cares? It makes up for makes up for the lateness. Ooh, they sailed me a curry today. I can't believe there are sealed people who have never er eaten curry in this day and age. And we got some extra hot spices. What do you think we do with that, viewers? That is the trading item you get for the this day. And I think you already know where I'm going to bring that to, but for now, let's go to the Fire Fortress. In the Fire Fortress, you will meet someone. You will know, you'll learn that someone has populated this area. And that would be... Oh. These are weapon cases. You can store items in here. That has something to do with it later. The uh, Traveling Brothers are here. They finally found a nice place. I've already told you about this stuff, so don't worry about it. Actually, we can talk. We can ask him about storing weapons. You see the five treasure chests over there? You can store one weapon in each chest. You can retrieve the weapon you put in here whenever you like. And it's not being very clear, but we'll see that maybe near the end of the game. Alright, so let's buy some info on upgrading weapons from this man. When a leaf form thorn is used, a paralysis attack is added. This special attack paralyzes your opponent. So, he gives us a leaf form thorn for free. This guy will actually give us more useful hints later on in the game, so I recommend buying his items whenever you can. It's better than having to fish for it. Now the last thing we have to do is beat up a rabbit. A rascally rabbit. And I think the best way to beat that rabbit is probably with a spin attack. Probably. So, let's see what we should do on him. Enchant Flare? We got Enchant Flare. Awesome. Let's go. It's gonna be so fun. I want. I cannot wait to see how much damage we're going to do with this rabbit. Let's go, son! Rampage Rabbit meets the spin attack! Oh crap, he, he actually moves. Ha, but you're in the you're in the corner now. You can't escape. Alright. Spin attack is so good. And for that we get a med kit. And that's actually a really good item. What the med kit does is that if we uh, if we die uh, in battle, the med or the med kit will give us another life. Another chance, if you would. If you use it normally, it recovers you to full health. Of course, no one would ever use it normally. One would use it when you absolutely need it. Alright, let's save and stop here. I'm going to take some time to uh, maybe do some research, and I will upload the video now. So here we go. This is Steamboy27, wishing you all a brighter tomorrow. Have a good day. Next time, I'll use that Fulger Horn to make another weapon. And... almost... done. There we go.